Let's continue with the next pattern, the request response communication style. The idea is to answer every request with a corresponding response message. This looks like this. So we as a client first send a message as a request, which gets transferred to the server. And the server then does its computation and returns a corresponding response message, which is the answer of this request. What are the benefits of this? We know that every request gets answered, which is a beautiful thing, right? We can detect timeouts. If the response takes too long, then we know that something happened. Windowing and buffered responses are also possible as performance optimizations. We don't have to answer every request. We can wait, for example, for five requests and then answer them all together. We have decoupled the communication events. Sending the request is a different communication event than receiving the answer. So these two are decoupled and we can wait in between. What are the drawbacks? A continuous data stream is not possible. If we have to send requests and wait for responses, then we cannot continuously send data over the stream, but have to stop in between and wait for the response. Broadcasts and multicasts are not possible or are more difficult because a response has to be sent to the original sender again. Therefore, it doesn't make sense to do some broadcasting or multicasting because the originator of a message can only be one client. Asynchronous communication is more difficult to debug. If you have to wait for the response, this may work or it may not work or it may take sometimes longer and sometimes shorter, and it's not deterministic when the response will be received. And how do we handle errors? If the server has some error, do we get an error response then? Do we define an error message, a special error message as a response? Or what to do if we get no response? Did the server then receive our message, but had a problem during processing? Or didn't the server receive the request at all and there is a communication problem 